Hello everybody and this is Abundant and welcome to part 2 of my smudge signature tutorial. Now in the last part I showed you guys how to place your render and background and that's pretty simple but now we're going to start to speed things up. We're going to start stepping it up. So let's get to the smudging. Now if you missed the part where I told you all about my settings if you don't want to go all the way back to the video and fast forward all the way through and hear it I'll repeat it again I'm using a 4 pixel hard brush on 100% hardness normal mode the mode is set to normal strength 86 I don't know why that's set to 84 <laughs> 86 now if you click this tool right here like this box that has the brushes in the bucket you want to make sure that shape dynamic shape dynamics are turned on with control pen pressure and smoothing is clicked now let's get to smudging um I know most people will probably when they start smudging you're gonna see the colors are gonna look completely different and you're gonna have like if you pull from a, a red you're gonna hit the background it's gonna pull it's gonna pull every other color it's gonna pull a gray it's gonna turn to blue but once our smudging is done and everything is finished and we start to get into our adjustment stage you're going to see I'm going to sh uh, not really see but I'm going to you know what I'm going to show you guys how to get all the colors in the image in in the in the signature to match up uh, if most of you are wondering why I sound like crap it's because I'm sick and it's been a long time since I've done videos so don't try to be too harsh Okay, this is probably going to take a while. <laughs> so, on this part, I think I might speed the video up <laughs> because I forgot how long it takes to do smudging. Now, if you're using a mouse, it's fine because I use a mouse most people don't believe I do but I do I use a mouse smudging is hard with a mouse but once you master the technique it becomes so much easier oh here's another thing guys if you get to the point where your render is cut off like right here if you look my re there's no more render and I have to pull the colors you can do it easier way by if you have a bright source in the background you can pull it like this down to your render that way when you create the next line you'll have that red color to pull from and then you can just pull this back down again so you wanna you know you wanna add darker colors with lighter colors to give it that sense of feeling of having it adds depth let's just say it that way I'm not going to use big term words and etc so let's let's go out some and see how our smudging is looking now right now it looks nah doesn't look good you got red gray and dark red and you got this orangey nasty color So, we'll just keep smudging at this part if you guys want. Listen to me some music, you know. Find something that influences you. You know, always do a signature based off on your mood. So, like, if you're angry, make a signature that replicates your anger if you're happy make a signature that replicates your happiness and if you're in love ooh la la 
make a signature that replicates how love how in love you are. And if you're just lazy, then just make a lazy looking signature. So right now, I'm actually liking the way that the smudging is coming out. It's coming out pretty sick right now. Most of you are probably going to be looking at this like, I can't tell how good it looks right now. All I see is a bunch of lines. If you're that way, then you shouldn't be doing graphics. Honestly, that's the cold fact of reality. So, I think we're going to stop here after I finish this little area. And we're going to continue in the next part. Uh, yeah, that looks good. We'll continue in our next part. But before I go, I want to tell you guys about the forums that I'm part of. And I would like you all to check it out and register on it. And, you know, see what you can uh, learn on it. The link is posted in the link in my description below. And when you register, just put me as your referral. If not, you don't have to. Uh, this is Abundant signing off.